latest Jubilee video seems up my alley. Why is it up my alley? Six women versus one secret MILF. <laughs> this is actually up my alley. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, let's let's see. Six women versus one secret MILF. Is she the is she the MILF? I am not a mom. I am not a mom. I am not a mom. The first one was kind of a MILF. I am not a mom. Not a mom. I'm not a mom. I'm not a mom. Uh, I'm gonna be honest with you. It's the top left one, I think. Yeah, it's the top. I think that's the MILF. What do you guys do for work? I have two jobs, so I'm working anywhere from on the low end, 60 to 80 hours a week. I'm a business manager. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's crayons. Wait, what do you say you do? I'm a business manager and then also a head chef. Yeah. <laughs> that's cool. You're in your grind era. Listen, I, uh, business manager, head Trigan chef. Trigan Films super chatted $1.99. Nine How do I become a member? What do you mean, how do you become a member? You've given me like $600, which you have to stop doing. <laughs> what? Stop. How do you mean how do you become a member? I don't know, there's a membership link in the description. <laughs> Bro, that's wild. <laughs> okay, so let me just move on. I like that. What do you do for a living? I'm a video editor. Oh, oh, cool. oh I work at CBS right now. I am an interior designer. That's definitely the mom. She works at CVS. Sure. I've been doing it about three years. I'm still in school, but I'm working for a firm in Costa Mesa. I work for a nonprofit in STEM, so science tech. Oh. When I do science videos on the side, I'm Asian Bill Nye kind of. Oh. <laughs> I like that. So I was a nursing major for a while, but realized I hated it. So left school, tried to figure out what I really wanted to do. So for the meantime, I am a bartender and server. Nice. Yeah. It's, uh, it's this woman right here, right? Like we all agree. Sharon. She said she was a bartender part-time. I figured that would be a typical side gig. Part-time mom, part-time bartender. I work at Starbucks. Come on. Part-time. Oh, but then I'm a full-time student. She's like five years old. She's not a mom. Get out of here. Or she's like, that's like the hook. Summer with an O. Somer. <laughs> what? Who named you? Well, so. Oh, what are you studying? Okay. I'm studying health science. It's um, healthy lifestyles coach and fitness science. Wow. What's your favorite kids show? I don't like Arthur. Growing up. <laughs> Arthur's great. I was a Teletubbies girl. Oh, they're making a comeback. Oh. Yeah. The new Purple Wiggle. Oh, it's, oh, it's, a, it's a black girl. My favorite kids show is uh, anything with a cartoon mom in it. <laughs> Dexter's Lab, Danny Phantom, you know, any of those. No, the purple one? Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's one. Like, she's cool, but then there's another one where it's the guy, and then they're remaking Blue's Clues oh. with a new <laughs> Steve. Right. As a girl. Or no, it's the guy. the guy. But it's like... The updated Steve. So cool. But. Yeah. So yeah. I was a little suspicious. Adam and Eve, more like Adam and Steve. Of Jade and uh, Susan, because they were saying shows that are recent and like the changes of the shows that were happening. So it was kind of just like. I've already made my determination. So I, I don't care what any of them say. You guys are watching kids shows. You might have kids. Do you guys have Whoa, kids? Whoa, hot take. <laughs> but they would also hide that from you as well because they're trying to throw you off the scent. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So so I have a lot of you guys have dogs? Okay. Yeah. I, have two dogs. I do. I have two, I have two dogs, dogs too. Aww. Yes. I have four. I have two dogs. They're uh, they're dachshunds. <laughs> I call them paradoxins. It's like a paradox. You know, it's like a joke. Oh. Okay. I have oh, two dang. snakes as well. Oh, snakes? Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, I want a dog, but my apartment won't let me have it. So. How does anyone feel about kids in yeah. general? They're, they're so right. I like them. I want to have a baby. I'm pretty excited actually to have one. Looking forward to having a baby with my wife. For school, for sure. I like to give yeah, them, give them back like to their moms. Monsters. <laughs> <laughs> oh. yeah. But like cute monsters. Yeah. Yeah. If you like this episode and Ah I don't think he's a mom. If you want to see more, make sure to like uh, this video and this. subscribe to our channel. Now let's figure right. out who the mole is. Maybe. The outfit that Sharon was wearing seemed kind of momish. She radiated badass mom energy. I was just like, damn. Damn. Let's see if I was right. I don't think that I she's I think they enough. were suspecting me based off of the comment I made about the kids shows with Blue's Clues and the Wiggles. I was like, oh, dang it. I just saw that on TikTok type of thing. That was intense. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. All right, round two. Guys, like, show me how to change a diaper. I mean, I've had- Why would they do that though? Because they, they want to stay secret. At a wipe experience. Oh, okay. Oh, you just have a membership. The assertiveness of Jade. I was like, oh, the fact that she came up with that so quickly. Maybe she's a mom herself. Oh, it took her like eight hours ago. I was like, well, how do you change a diaper? Oh, it must be her. Get out of here, bro. I'm starting to suspect you. The assertiveness of Jade. I'm a suspecting you now, Sharon. I have a little hesit. I'm a suspecting. I'm a suspecting of you, a Sharon. Oh, what's happening? Something's taking over my brain. I was like, oh, the fact that she came up with that so quickly. Maybe she's a mom herself. Um, like, let's imagine the baby's like on the floor, I guess. Or not the floor. Did you know. you like <laughs> I just know you 
lift up the legs and wipe. I think I was making myself worse at it because I was like, I'm not gonna show you guys that I know how to change a diaper and exactly. make it seem as though I'm a mom. Even though it's not just an act that is centered for moms, like family members know how to do that. I thought that was gonna be a great idea and it turns out I got nothing from that question. No knowledge at all, except for that it was a bad question. Do you guys want kids? I don't think so right now. I just feel like there's so much life that I still wanna like live mm -hmm. and I'm definitely okay with waiting. Hmm. I'm 26, I do not want kids right now. My mom actually- Like, uh, not for nothing, but like, I feel like a MILF can't be under 30. You know, like, my here's my thing. I don't think a, a MILF can be under 30. It's not just that you have a kid. It's that you're also, I think, older as well. You know, it's not, oh, I have a one-year-old. That's not a MILF. Your kid has to be at least, like, 10. You know, you have to be a seasoned mom. You gotta have that seasoning on you. You're not a MILF the second the baby comes out of your cooter. You know what I mean? Because at that point, you definitely don't want to fuck them. Their vagina is a mess, right? Am I right, doctors? Give that. Put in an extra stitch, doctor. Don't do that. I'm just kidding. That's horrible. Um, but I think that there needs to be <laughs> there needs to be more parameters than just as a kid. You had me and my sisters young. I was able. No, a cougar's like a 50 year old milf. I don't know. Actually, I don't even think cougars have to have kids. It's just like an older woman that's attractive. Well, to just see that second hand on the struggle. I want to travel more. Yeah. I'm married. Me and my oh, husband. Oh, oh. Ew. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> my mom had my brother and I pretty late. And I think once she really figured out her life and did everything she wanted to do was the perfect time. And she didn't want to have kids until my grandma, because she's from Malaysia. Mm -hmm. um, my mom told her, I'm not having these kids unless you come to America and help me take care of them. Whoa. So she wanted to make sure she had all the support. She cool. just was not being direct about if she did want kids or if she didn't want kids at all. She was just talking about her mom's experience. So I was just like, it might be. You kind of just talk. I just want to have kids so that I can uh, have a lot of kid snacks in the house and have a, a reason to eat them. I want to eat baby food. I don't think I'm going to give my kid baby food. I think I'm going to make my own baby food. Like, I'm going to puree it because there's too much salt in there, you know? About your mom's um, perspective. So, is our children, like, in your future? Is it something that you would like? Yeah, when I think of MILFs, I think about high school boys talking about each other's moms or something. Yeah, exactly. Remember that song, Stacy's Mom? I re that song resonated with me when I was a kid. Because who doesn't want to fuck someone's hot mom? You know? to have one day or I literally just had this conversation with somebody else and it's very I'm not a hard yes or a hard no I think it just really depends on where I am in my life and it also depends on the person I'm having kids with that's yeah, that's yeah. So true. what do you guys think of the term queen. MILF like what do you what do you vision what it, do you honestly that word isn't it like the most popular category on like <laughs> it's up there it's like I really fetish <laughs> an independent woman My who's just like, I got kids and yeah. 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 There's an association I think with the term MILF. Like you said, typically they're pretty independent. Are, are they single mom? Are they single mom? When the fuck are you talking about that? I've never heard of MILF being independent. Maybe from a fantasy scenario, you'd hope that they don't have a husband. <laughs> but uh, what the hell are you talking about? Have I seen like the crazy people who chew food up and spit it in their kid's mouth? They go, bro, it's fucking wild. Maybe they're doing that to pass on their immunities. <laughs> Here's some bacteria for you to process, baby. Um, and that's oh, why they're being they're associated with milk. All mothers are beautiful. But I think like Incorrect. The milk, like biblical milk is probably It's beautiful to be a mother, but not all of them are beautiful. Let's just be I'm not trying to be rude, okay? Probably the mom who If I was if I wasn't married, I'd say that though, so that you'd hit me up in the DMs and you'd show me your tits. But I'm ma I'm married, don't do that. Gotta do a little bit of amen. We have to do a Hosea in the highest. Hosanna in the highest soon, sorry. Who still has her identity. The That's values. a great way to put it. They still watch like Weird Al videos on their free time, or they still like <laughs> do whatever weird stuff they did before having the kid. What do you guys do in your free time? I go to the gym. I can tell. Yeah. And I study. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I'll do some chores and jerk off. I go to the gym. I have fur babies of my own, and I love to spend time with them. Uh, honestly, just anything, just going out, events. I'm kind of the opposite. I'm chronically online. I uh, don't get out much. When I do, it's usually for like a cool like metal concert. I'm trying to get back into entertainment Again, I do some music on the side, and you said it. that woman is definitely a stay-at-home mom. Like she's the mom. Again, what stopped you from entertainment? Oh uh, well, just you know, just work. I mean, I'll having a kid. She's the milf. I've already identified it the instant that I saw it. I already, I'm right. Okay, and if I'm wrong, we're gonna end the video here. I don't know, but uh, it's definitely her. She had a kid, and she needed to work while her husband made money. <laughs> That's it. Want to do more than but also she's you know like i mean everybody's like i'm a musician you know that just doesn't pan out for everybody just cbs long term so i'm trying to get into real estate too i'm just, just going to study that next month and oh, yeah, um yeah just different things that's just kind of what i'm doing for income on, on, 
uh, currently, but yeah. She's a, she's a, she's she was stumbling on her words and moving around a lot after I had asked her about the entertainment industry. I um, really enjoy work. I know that's yeah. like kind of taboo, but yeah. I like to make money. It I gives me a lifestyle yeah. that is comfortable. Same, my, sure, my work breathes into my life and I love my job because it's yeah. freelance. I get to work whenever I want, wherever I want. The fuck is Lance, bro? So. I started to get scared because I was like, it's either Jade or I can't trust anyone. In I'd be terrible at these because I would just walk in with like a with a with a sense of like authority and say it's that person. <laughs> I would be like, it's them. I would instantaneously say it's that person, and I might even be right. I would ruin the whole show, and then everybody would vote for me. Like, okay, this segment was over five minutes, and it's like, oh yeah, because I'm fucking right, bro. Who's the milf? Her. Done. We're done. Here. <laughs> Of the votes, and we have a three way tie. Whoa, Kristen, Yowza. Jade, and Sharon. Each one of you will have 30 seconds to state your case. Here's the thing I can barely take care of myself. I mean, I hate to admit this, but most days I don't wake up before like 11 a.m. because I have such a screwed, weird sleep schedule because I stay up all night and okay. I don't see sun as much as I should. And also, I ah, see, she admits she doesn't see her son as much as she should. She's the she's the mom now. I'm just kidding. I'm kind of terrified of passing a human through my body. There's I love work. Moms don't work, so it's <laughs> yeah. Moms can't work. That's what the that's what goes on. That um, I don't really think I'm financially stable to have a baby right now, and that's that's a, always the perfect time to have a baby. At least that's what high schoolers think. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much. Uh... I'm still saving it for a dog. <laughs> like that's what my goal is right now, and. Uh... Typical woman, of course. Definitely don't want a child. I don't have money. Let me save it for a dog. Anytime soon. So. <laughs> I mean, same case. I'm not in the best financial situation. I think that she's just trolling, so people don't think she's the male. A couple months ago, I really accepted the fact that I was just going to be homeless until I truly believe in miracles. I ended up living with a roomie. But, I mean, exactly what she said. The thought of passing a baby right. through me, I'm just, because you hear all the horror stories of birthing someone. I'm just like, do I really want to go through that? But again, going back to the hard yes or hard no, there are just so many factors that are dependent. All right, now vote again. Hurry up. Uh, wait, is she the MILF? I kind of was just letting everyone speak before. I think that's why I got voted out. It's probably just because I was quieter. You think the Does that mean that she's not the MILF? Am I wrong? Who was it? Fuck. Is still in the box and you'd like to continue what? How the fuck am I wrong? God damn it. Well, fuck me, man. In the game, please raise your hand. Right, who's the MILF now? It's either her or her. It's one of these two. I don't know which one. Okay. For every person you vote out that is not the mole, the money will be reduced in half. Whoa. <laughs> okay, right, so let's, let's just be like, let's just say it. Right? Yeah, when was your kid born? <laughs> I don't have a kid, but uh, let's be direct. We think it's either you or you. Let's be direct. Let me show me your pussy. <laughs> Let me see your fucking pussy. That's the most direct way to figure out. <laughs> either you look at their stomach, at their surgical scar, or you look at the condition of their vagina. <laughs> That's the only way that you can make this determination. That's it. And the reason Water. I think it's you is because I actually think it's you, but I, but they think it might be you. I think it's you. Yeah, because you weren't sure about the baby question. Mm -hmm. You're like, talked about your mom a little bit. And why I think it's you is sleep schedule. Like if you have a baby, you're probably up at weird hours of the night. You know what I mean? Exactly. Even though I am too. My antidepressants make me sleep like 12 hours a day. Okay. So that's a big part of it. Fair, fair. <laughs> yeah. Do you guys have any uh, meaningful tattoos that you guys are comfortable showing right now? This is my dad, he died last year. Oh, this is a signature. Yeah, it's my only it. one though. Uh, I just got this tattoo on the back of my leg. It says all is well, well is all. Oh, that's oh, so cool. Oh, what is the oh, oh, I have a butterfly on my wrist. Oh, I have a fucking, I have a hummingbird behind my ear. Oh, bro. Like, come on, bro. I only have one. It's a G. It's um, my best friend's first name, Gabby. Like, Your <laughs> best friend? I know. Yeah. Really? Yeah. I love my best friend. I don't have her tattooed on me. Oh. Look, I love my best friend. Don't have her name tattooed on me. So I was like, that's a child. That's You have a child's name tattooed on you. So I was going to say, I have. My mom got a tattoo. My mom's getting tattoos as she gets older, and she got a tattoo, and I forget what it was. Oh, I made. She's like, oh, I'm going to get a new tattoo. And I was like, what are you going to get? A fucking infinity symbol on your wrist? That is what she got. And she... <laughs> I guessed it. She had already gotten it. I was like, uh, of course you are. Of course you're going to do a fucking infinity symbol. 
Women are crazy, bro. I have my grandmother the day she was born to the day she passed away with an infinity sign in her name. And then Metallica is one of my favorite bands. No, it's See? not. It are is. you serious? Yeah. What? And it's I so have an uh, a Metallica inspired tattoo on my inner arm. That oh. is such a cool. I put my hand down. I just punched the fuck out of my balls. Surprise. I have this because I just saw it on the internet and I thought it was cute. Yeah, I, um, I got this with my best friend. See, she has a best friend. I that's yeah. like, yeah. hey, but it, is it your best friend's initial? No, it's mine. It's it. Oh, that's oh. cute. What's your relationship what? with your baby's father? What's it like? You guys talk a lot or? I don't have one. <laughs> See, I'm really bad at this. I'm not this. You said you're married, but do you guys live alone or do you live with other people? Mm, do you have a partner? Um, it's a complicated situation right now. Mm. Aren't they? Well, maybe, she, maybe she's the baby it's her. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like that. Yeah. But I live by myself though. Okay. okay. Mm -hmm. I'm living with family and I recently broke up with my boyfriend. Mm. He didn't deserve you. Oh. <laughs> I live with a roommate. Okay. And my cat. Mm. Um, also a roommate, but two dogs and then her dog too. Cute. I just live with my husband and then our two dogs. Oh. All right, all right. Okay. Just because she was also giving a very loving, comforting energy where she's like, all right, it's almost giving. Come on, kids, let's get together and let's talk about this some more. Well, maybe she's a groomer. So you never know nowadays. Once the first round passed, I only was paying attention to her. <laughs> Ooh, I got her. I really didn't think I gave any kind of mom energy. If you think the mole is still in the box and you'd like to continue playing the game, please raise your hand. Don't play me all. I really just sit down. I'm so scared. The lights turn green. That means you have voted the mole. Chatty guy super chatted $2. Hey, papa, is there going to be more EDP 445 content? Don't think so. What do you want me to do? Call him up and see if he'll like to go after another kid? <laughs> I hope not. I was I was hoping his kidney uh, his kidneys would uh would you know? The answer is no. I don't think so. I hope there is no more of that. Pull out and you all win. The light turns red. I have a couple tattoos, yeah. That means the mole is still in the box and you lose. Oh God. Period. Period. Oh. Okay, work. You're not a mom. No, neither you. So sorry. <laughs> That's a very cute idea, by the way. I if I was a red pillar, oh, they're not. They're, they're, and I saw them high fiving, saying they're not moms. Like, these women are wasting their biological clock not being moms. Women are just here to pump out babies. You know, that's what my my reaction would be. Yeah. My friend said that. Yeah. That's very sweet. On my count, the mole will step forward and reveal themselves. I thought that they already got the mole. I thought it was her. Three, Who is two, it? One. Eight. Oh, they got her first? Oh, oh why didn't that game end at that point? I actually have a 19-year-old and a 14-year-old. Yeah. I am a teen. I was a teen mom. Great yeah. inspiration. Yeah. That's I mean, I don't know about the inspiration, but God bless. I, bro, she's the mom. So I already, I'm not, I don't, I don't believe it. I do get called a MILF. I take it as a compliment. It depends on who it comes from. If it's coming from another mom, another female, then I'm like, okay, real recognizes real. But then if it comes from a male, I'm like, okay, somebody's been on the little orange and black block site. And then I kind of try to stay away. What? They just, they're just, hey, they're just saying they want to fuck you. Yeah. That's, I can never imagine that making a woman feel uncomfortable to call them a MILF. Is it the you were the only one. It's funny. Well, my wife has a kid. I'm going to call her MILF all the time. I smack her ass and shit. So it's funny because I voted this way and then you were. <laughs> I feel so bad. I just want to apologize. I was no. dead on you every round. But it's a compliment. But honestly. I wanted it's to like you're sweet. Yeah, I didn't understand the rules of the game. I thought that the, the, once they voted someone out, that was the mole that would have ended. In maternal and it's like, yeah. No, yeah. which, you know, I do take that as a compliment because I feel like I have zero maternal instincts and maybe oh, I do because, like, I have two fur babies. Right. So well, I'm like, my go. baby. Mother Motherhood, which is within womanhood, comes in so many different forms. I just picture like a hot mom driving her Range Rover with the kids in the back, just a boss lady. I think that at the end yeah. of the day, taking the word back, like, hell yeah, I'm a MILF. And you know, you don't have to worry about what the weird kind of uh, like yes, pervy the, people. The classic uh, MILF slur. They'll say, it's like, it's a word of empowerment. Come on, this, and you just like, it. is, this how, oh. is that how you do it? Is this, oh, I'm sorry. Is that how you do it? Uh oh, that's how you do it. Hope you brought an umbrella. Okay. Well, that's cool. That was a nice bit of uh, content there.